So let's let's talk a little bit about the Disney legacy because you have had experience working for some of the other organizations <coughs> mentioned here. So to your mind, what defines the Disney legacy and what sets Disney apart from other organizations? The people. And I've been asked this question before. What well, what is my biggest take on the Disney organization is the people. Without the people that puts this company together, we wouldn't be here today. And uh, from the top to the bottom, they were all, they were all neat people. They all had a vision for whatever they were doing, no matter where you were. And it's, I don't know, it worked. There was something that Walt hatched when he started Disneyland, and it continues through this day. It's, uh, it's a neat, amazing legacy in his response because I don't think anybody else could have pulled off what he did, especially not in 1955, getting that park open with no money, basically, or very little money. But anyway, the, the people make it. That's the bottom line. Even Bob Gurr. Even <laughs> <laughs> yeah, even Bob. 